Hello Virgos, welcome to Beauty True Tarot and this reading is from 20th of February to 28th of February. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Virgos, what you can expect in this week. Three of Skulls. Temperance, Strength, Six of Scepters, Nine of Knives, and Death. So here we have Strength, Virgos. It's about uh, finally getting your courage back because seems like um, this is an ending with this card of death something has to end something that is not um, making any sense but bothering you because with this nine of knives seems like you are in a lot of pain this person might be ignoring you they might be making you feel like you are alone even after being in this relationship it's you who is doing everything you are making all the efforts you are doing things that they are supposed to do in spite of that um, you may feel like something is lacking or something is just not right this person may not be reciprocating your love or they are taking your love for granted with the three of skulls this could be about losing something that you loved dearly Virgo this could be about uh, letting something go that meant a lot to you now this could be about a relationship but probably this relationship is not something that you deserve this could be a toxic relationship for many of you but you might be afraid that you have created this web with a lot of effort with a lot of love and um, you know stopping this weaving or you know pulling a thread may destroy everything you may end up losing everything yourself this person and um, whatnot this could be something that is, um, you know, making you uncomfortable. You might be afraid that if you choose yourself or if you tell this person their boundaries, you may lose them or you may end up alone. But the fact is, something inside you is screaming with this card of temperance, Virgo. Your subconscious is telling you that it's time to recognize your fire. It's time to recognize that um, um, maybe you are putting your fire into something that is actually putting it down. I mean, um, here you see this fire in this water. So no matter how much you are trying to ignite the passion or ignite the fire in this relationship, this person is doing everything possible to ruin your mood, to put it off, to put the fire off. I mean, that excitement off. And um, with the strength, Tarot is asking you, are you sure that you want something that you don't deserve? I mean, with the strength, Tarot is reminding you, you have the strength to get over everything. You have the strength to conquer. I mean, here we have this six of scepters. Tara is telling you that you are victorious and you can get over everything and anything. Six of scepters is about recognizing your worth. Finally getting what you deserve. Six of scepters is about um, being your own master. And the very first thing that you can do in this direction is to... Uh, find out what you actually want. Tarot is telling you to draw the boundaries. 
if you want to stay in this relationship or leave. That's totally your choice. But the tarot and the universe is telling you that you need to let this person know what is okay and what is not with you. You are not going to lose anyone genuine because of that. Six of Scepters is telling you that maybe you are too afraid to lose something that even doesn't deserve your attention. So look carefully. It's about looking inside you and finding the warrior that you always uh, were and you always will be. However, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reverse as well also you can check your moon and rising sign let's go ahead and check some more messages for you three of scepters the moon ace of skulls a lot of scepters and four of grains yes so here we have this moon. With this moon. Seems like you have been there for too long. Virgo. You have been searching for meaning in this love. You have been searching um, for reasons to stay there. You might have been ignoring a lot of red flags. And... Um, Maybe you had this hope that this lot of sectors will change. A lot of sectors could be about someone who is quite irresponsible. Um, they're really charming. This could be someone who is really fl flirtatious and uh, was constantly flirting around. You were expecting some change in them because you love them so much. You felt that this love will change them. But the tarot is telling you. That maybe you are hurting yourself by uh, accepting something that is not worthy of you. Also by ignoring something that you need to do. With the three of scepters, maybe many of you are in a long distance relationship. Also this card is about new kind of journey. A journey that starts from you and ends, ends inside you. I mean, this is something... Um, that you need to start at this point. You need to know yourself. Maybe you have put a lot of energy after this person. So much so that you are drained with this four of graves. Probably this person was um, draining your energy. They were constantly uh, making you feel vulnerable. This person might have left you tired emotionally. And... Um, you may feel like you are not able to fight for yourself. Take some rest. Tara is telling you that, you know, start a new journey. Take some rest. And think about this whole situation. Because I have this Ace of Skulls here. Virgo. Maybe this is a blessing in disguise. Universe is trying to tell you that something is waiting for you. Okay, some things are happening because uh, those things are taking you there where you are supposed to be. Something is waiting on you and uh, these things are only taking you in that direction. Let's check an oracle message for you. Messages for Virgos. Voices. With a tuck at the gut, feel them romance your very breathe. Listen to the gentle flickering within your eyes, for this is where they guide. As I said that you need to listen to your inner voice. You will feel like uh, everything is telling you something. Some kind of message is being uh, given to you in different ways. Maybe some stranger will come and give you some advice that will... Mm, feel like the right one you may meet someone who has the same situation and uh, you know out of nowhere they will start discussing it and uh, you will be inspired by how they um, change their situation 
Universe will try to reach out in many ways. You may have dreams. You may have intuitions. You may see a lot of synchronicities, quotes, or um, some songs that are telling you something. So a lot of voices are there. Try to listen to them. So this was the reading for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.